Thou shalt not kill. Uh, thou shalt not commit fornication. Fornication. Uh, what else? Love thy neighbor. That's three. Uh, how many more you want? Um, <laughs> thou shalt honor a mother and father. That's four. Uh, thou shalt not get on TV <laughs> and, and, get, and get asked these questions. Can you name any of the Ten Commandments? Um, not to kill. Thou shalt not kill. I know stealing's one of them, right? And then um, don't don't covet your neighbor's stuff, like your like their wife and stuff like that. Let's see, Ten Commandments. I think there's ten of them. Okay, I don't know. Do you know any of the Ten Commandments? Can you name the Ten Commandments? No. And, um... Give me one. Red Dog, Miller, Bush, <laughs> Rolling Rock. Isn't Zima a beer? That's like six. I think that's about it. Heineken, Budweiser, Old Style, uh, Red Dog, Bush, Red Wolf, Red Wolf. Natural no, Don't forget that. What's that Mexican beer like? Guinness, Foster's, Back. Uh, Budweiser, Corona. Tres X, I'm still light, I'm some poly girl. One more? I'm gonna look like an alcoholic. <laughs> uh, Current Amstel Light, Coors, Coors Light, Miller, Miller Light, Bud, Bud Light, Corona, Heineken, um, Molson. Okay, there we go. <laughs> okay, that's good, your name's in. How did you do? Ask yourself, do you place more importance on other things rather than understanding and keeping God's commandments? It's important to keep his commandments, for John 14.21 says, He that loves me keeps my commandments, and he that loves me shall be loved by my Father, and I will love him and manifest myself to him. Romans 2.15 states, The laws are written on our hearts, and our conscience bears witness. The Lord has made it known to us in the scriptures of right and wrong. God has given us a conscience. Con equals with, science equals knowledge, so we sin with knowledge. The moral law, or the Ten Commandments, reveals the nature and the will of God, and it still applies today. Psalms 19.7 states, The law of the Lord is perfect, converting the soul. The law was given to show man their sin and their need of a Savior, our perfect sacrifice, Jesus Christ. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear God and keep his commandments, for this is the whole duty of man, Ecclesiastes 12.13. And you shall teach them, your children, speaking of them, the Ten Commandments, when you sit in your house, and when you walk by the way, when, light, when you lie down, and when you rise up. And you should write them upon the doorposts of your house, and upon your gates. Deuteronomy 11, verses 19-20. through 20. Amen. <laughs>